Another demonstration this afternoon in Wilkes-Barre, but this one was a little different. This one was for children. Newswatch 16's Chelsea Strube at the Mini March. We are one is the Black Lives Matter message 11-year-old Anaya Sanders chose for her poster during a demonstration at Kirby Park in Wilkes-Barre. A demonstration that might look a little different than others you've witnessed before. This one's different because it's mainly for kids to learn about the Black Lives Matter movement. And it's to help smaller kids that don't really know what's happening right now understand more about this. We just want the kids to know that their voices matter and that this is a safe and peaceful way to get their voices out and their opinions to really make real change in, in our world, in our community, and, and hopefully throughout all of America and globally to make sure that everything is safe for all people, no matter what your skin color looks like. The demonstration not only included a march, but also a one-on-one -on -one opportunity with police officers in the community. They could have an open dialogue and a discussion with the police and talk about their feelings and the cops could kind of reassure them that they're here to protect and serve and that we all could live peacefully and harmoniously in this world as if we could all just be kinder to each other. It makes me feel good that people are actually coming so they could like record and stuff and post it on the internet so that it gets out to the people. Candace Eckler is one of the organizers. She says her nine-year-old son's interest in racial justice is what sparked the idea to create this safe, peaceful environment for kids to demonstrate, but also inspire unity. What does unity look like? This is what unity looks like. He's learned about Dr. Martin Luther King, um, so he understands that peaceful protest and making your voices heard has made a difference. And when he saw what happened, he wanted to be a part of that. Organizers hope this is the first of many fun and educational demonstrations for children to take place here in Wilkes-Barre. Chelsea Strube, Newswatch 16, Luzerne County.